I'm Eli, or Toasty. My name is Jackson Carter. My name is Jesus Para, also known as Gimmick. My teammates are great. Uh, I've been teaming with the Gimmick for about a year now, and we just picked up Ajax, and he's been doing phenomenal. You know, it's hard to step into LJ's shoes, but I think he's done a really great job. Toasty and Gimmick made it really easy for me. I'm just super comfortable. They just let me come in, do what I want to do, play how I want to play, and I can adapt to them, they adapt to me. We just mesh really well. I'm glad we were able to prove some people wrong so far in the short amount of time we've been in the team. And yeah, so far it's been nothing but good times. My name is Ron Skin. I started as a player. Um, I played from 2016 to 2018. I uh, competed in the low end of the bubble scene before I transitioned into coaching. I really wasn't a part of RLCS until coaching and moved across a couple different rosters until I found my home with Team Axel. Ronskin really allows us to play how we want and then he watches how we play and tweaks it just to make it better. But he, he just lets us be comfortable. I like it a lot. Yeah, working with Ronskin has been nothing but good vibes. Uh, he's, yeah, I could tell he's very passionate about his job and that's really the only thing you need when it comes to a coach in Rocket League. Someone that would help you in times where you probably don't know how to help yourself. Ronskin knows a lot about the game. He knows like, he, he looks at it from the professional's perspective, not just a coach's perspective. He's able to take that into account, which is great. You know, he, he contributes new ideas, new play style, like things that we need to work on, things we should implement. He's done a great job. The beautiful thing about coaching is it's individualized. So I was fully expecting everything that I've done in the past not to work with this current roster. The number one thing was to learn the guys, learn how they react, and. Uh, learn their play styles, how to optimize everything, and I think our performance this past fall was a good showing of, of that. I think I'm most excited about just playing, playing more with the team, getting more matches in, more series in. I think that's always the most fun part for me. I'm excited and playing more regionals as a more developed team. You know, our first split was kind of like a test run, and I think we finally figured stuff out, especially in that third regional. So going into winter and spring, I think we're going to do great. For winter, I hope we crack into the top 10, maybe top 8. And then for the spring, I'd like to be top 5. Is it go to Wolves? Of course. I would love to get into that top 10 space. I think that would be my expectation. Um, we, we deserve that. We need that. Going above, like I think finishing 11th in fall um, is slightly above. Top 16 would have been, okay, new roster, blah, blah, blah. Um, but getting into the top 10, top eight space, being able to take top four teams and take series off top four teams, uh, you gotta take it in steps. And, and I really think top 10, top eight is a realistic goal for us as a team.